down below on the Nichols and Jolina sloops are here. Galley to port. Uh, galley stove's not in there at the minute. Chart desk to starboard. And this has a, uh, a plywood board that goes in to be used as a, a chart desk uh, when the quarter berth's not in use. But good size quarter berth there. Instrumentation. Engine box with a three cylinder beta, twin batteries. Um, galley here, got a sink with uh, manual water tap and quite a bit of storage here underneath. These nice half height bulkheads with vertical grab rails and also uh, grab rails above you as well, either side. So moving through the boat is quite easy. Port and starboard saloon berths with a bit of extra foot room at the aft end. Saloon table leaves that fold up either side. You can see lots of storage space, various lockers in here. You can see these uh, galvanised knees, which stretch from the coach roof deck beams all the way down the combing, under the side deck, around the beam shelf and down. And there's three of those in way of the mast either side and that create a huge amount of stiffness in the hull. You can see the beam shelf here is doubled up also in way of the mast from about here to same amount forward of the mast, giving a lot of extra stiffness where the uh, chain plates are. Keel step mast with a modern alloy mast. Heads compartment, Jabsco manual sea toilet. And here's a hand basin pulls out. Hanging locker to port, and then the four cabin. Two good sized berths, four hatch above, and the anchor locker in here. So uh, good amounts of storage space around here. 